Today I'm going to do my first ever unboxing video. Uh, kind of a big day here at Diddy House because we've got a really, really big lawn. And um, my wonderful next door neighbor uh, did me the favor of mowing for me last year when I was moving in and uh, the beginning of this season. He's mowed a couple times for me, but uh, that's not why he bought his house next door. Um, so I needed to get my own mower and I decided to go with the Works Nitro. Uh, it's a 40 volt uh, PowerShare Pro, so I can swap the batteries with my other Works devices, uh, the 20, 20 volt batteries. Um, this is a self-propelled model and it has an adjustable handle, uh, both of which are important for me because I'm short and I also have mobility issues, so I pretty much can't mow my lawn without self-propel. So an electric lawnmower that has self-propel is pretty, pretty awesome. Now this thing is an absolute beast. That's why it's on the furniture dolly right now. I'm gonna get it off of here. And I think I need to lay it down uh, to do my unboxing because um, this side is completely blank. Um, so I don't think it's a stand up open. So, anyway, I'll get to it. And yes, Mom, I am wearing my back brace under here. Don't worry. First, I'm going to look for loose things before I stand the box back up. Because this is definitely a walkout. Uh, that looks like the side chute. Yep, the side chute for the rest. Chargers. Charger. So these are the 5 amp uh, PowerShare Pro batteries. Um, I was told that these are swappable with any of the 20 volt PowerShare uh, batteries. They've got charge indicator on the back end. Ooh. And um, so I would probably be swapping these with my 4 amp, uh, my 4 amp hour batteries that I have for my string trimmer and my leaf blower. Um, those of course are only 
of these, but they should get me through the entire lawn, trimming, leaf blowing, etc. So anyway. Um, So I now have two of these since I have the uh, one for the string trimmer and leaf blower. So uh, I can now charge up four of these batteries all at one time. If you've only got one works, if this is your only works uh, tool that you have, uh, I think I remember this is the quick charge. So it takes about an hour to charge the batteries in between use. Uh, so next up, how to get this beast out. So I'm going to fold this back down, make sure I have oh, I don't anything falling on me. Okay, now there is nothing loose that could fall. Okay, and the other handle is here at the top, so I know that those wheels go down for storage. So I'm going to close this back up. Oh, this has been a bit entertaining. You can mulch it, you can blow out the side. Um, there we go. It has this LED light on the front. Now the handle, I'm told, has three different positions. Um, I can't put it all the way down right now because my table's in the way. Well, let's just set it on the table for a minute. Ah, what can you move? Okay, it's resting there for a moment. Uh, battery compartment um, has an indicator down here. Um, the LED headlights, it's really pretty bright, so if you've got uh, like trees, like I do, um, where you might on some days need to uh, see better. Uh, so you have the controller here for the uh, bag or mulch side discharge. Really super easy to control that. Um, I think this is a part, yeah, that's the part of the lock for the handle. Uh, for the handle settings, there's three different positions according to the manual that I read online. I need to download it. I, I just looked at it on my phone. I didn't actually download a copy. I'm going to download a copy now that I actually have this thing. Um, here, 
is what is this? Ah, uh, there is where the slide discharge chute hooks on to the motor. Spring loaded, so it's not going to come open anytime soon. Um, and uh, over here is the where is it? This side? Or maybe the other side. So here is the, um, that's the height adjuster thingy here, um, is spring loaded. So I have to look at the manual, um, where is it, this, ah, there we go. So this has the handle on it, and that can be done one-handed when you don't have your mower sitting on the table. Um, I'm going to pull this in just a little bit. controls your blade height. There's seven positions um, for how high or how low. Um, this is the min or max of the, um, the drive, as far as I remember. Um, like I said, I just glanced at the manual on my phone. I got to download it properly and read through it all. Uh, so, power button, <clears throat> um, so this is going to, I'm assuming, yeah, that's the switch for the actual motor itself, and then I believe, if I'm looking at this right, uh, this would be your drive. I have to look at the manual. Um, like I said, one did not come in the box. I'm not sure why, but uh, I suppose they're saving trees, which is uh, you know environmentally friendly since it's also not a petrol mower. So anyway, um, yeah, this is a little locking mechanism for the handle. Height. There's three different heights, and as you can see. too high because I have a bum shoulder and uh, Real quick uh, correction to the front end of the video. Um, I said several times 
that I had to check on things because I couldn't find the manual, and it turns out the manual was the very first thing that I took out of the box and didn't know it. Um, it was tucked up on the bottom side of the side graph chute inside of that bag. I didn't notice it there. I was looking in the box for it. Um, so that's where it is, if you're looking for it. Um, and uh, real quick uh, control correction. Um, the mower is just like an old car that has a separate ignition switch from a starter switch. Uh, you engage the orange button in order to turn the power on to the operating veil, and then uh, once the, you pull the black operating veil, you can let the orange button go. Um, and then the orange veil is to engage the self-propelled drive. So, um, thanks for watching this. Like and subscribe. All right. I completely forgot to mention because, like I said, this is my first ever unboxing video. Um, Positech Tool Corp, the makers of Works Tools, did not give me any money for making this video. They did not give me free tools. I bought my lawnmower out of pocket with a 15% coupon that I found on the internet. Thanks for watching Diddy House. Like and subscribe.